Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome to new Kenshi series. We are starting a Steve this time around. And look at this man. Look at his haircut. Look at his mustache. Look at this scar a skimmer gave him. He's a real man. Yes, he is Steve. Yes, he is. He is part of the Holy Nation. He's a very devout Okranite. And he carries around Holy Flame with him. Besides, he's iron junk iron club rusted junk it's amazing any case yes new series begins and this is the story of steve who as i mentioned is a devout okranite and starts in holy nation and uh, i don't know if he has any good relations with holy nation i guess we can just check that yeah 15 it's pretty good and that's that's what we're gonna try to do now the whole goal of this series let's look at this now steve what he wants to do is make the holy nation great again for that case he needs to fight the shack to the south the weird hivers in the fog islands he has to fight the skeletons in the floodlands he has to find the cannibals to the north and of course there's the skeletons in the iron valleys and the united cities off to the east so holy nation is basically Surrounded by enemies by enemies of state any kind of enemies But Steve, you know, he used to be part of a volunteer corps for uh, Some holy nation boys, right? But they threw him out because they said he's too unstable He's too I don't know crazy for them Well, Steve decided that's not gonna do He's gonna do his own thing. He's gonna get his own army and he's going to get his own thing going. Eventually. With time. But for now. Well. <laughs> we have a long way to go. Uh, also Steve does not like thieves. Thieves. Don't talk to me. Now we start with 200 cats. And that's about it. Uh, also I have a couple of new mods. One of those is. I'm looking for work. So that's one we're going to look into. But first. Let's buy Steve some dried meat. So he can at least. Uh, go on with that. That leaves us with 80 monies. It might not be good enough to buy a healing kit, but we'll see. Uh, maybe it will be. Actually, let's let's ask about this quest uh, thing he's got. I'm looking for work. Have good news for you. Won't you give that a go too? Uh, please explain it, my friend. You can work from a gatekeeper in town or from soldier in a bar. If done well, you will receive various rewards. Do you try it? Sure. Uh... I reached the client, you should get a job from the client. We have Mediator HN for Holy Nation. No, my allies, they're not there, but I'm guessing those are part of the uh, of the boys that will give us quests. So, uh, I'm gonna have to find a gatekeeper or a client in a bar. And they will give me quests. And quests can be like, go destroy certain people, go persuade certain people to come here and such and such. I've not actually play with it myself but you know it sounds interesting I'm gonna go pop into this general shop and see if you can buy us a healing kit hello friends how do you do fellow Ocranites show me your goods they do have this thing and it's 88 and we have 80 money yeah that's that's not so good I guess we're gonna have to find some those bandits out there and steal it off of them that would be perfect who is walking there Starving bandits, perfect timing. What's their speed? They run 50 miles per hour. How are you doing, Steve? 16, perfect. Okay, Steve, it's time we go play with these boys. Uh, chances are we can talk to one of these guys. Yes, in order to uphold the sanctity of our hallowed society, you must surrender your possessions for inquest, brother. I will show you my gear. There you go. See, I've got nothing to hide, my friend. Nothing to hide, but I wonder... That's a lot of starving bandits out there. Oh, these guys are gonna fight. Who wants to bet? These guys wanna fight. Let's go, let's go there. Steve, let's go out there. Okay, they missed. That's fine. Well, Steve, does these starving bandits have any hivers among them? Yes, they do. So they'll be fast. Maybe not. Attack them, Steve. Attack them. Uh, now, the question is... Steve, as a fighter, 
is not going to be very good. So this is going to be probably a lost cause. Very much so. <laughs> so what we want to do is uh, get this guy. Let's get more. Can we do attack all? And get more of them here? Let's just bring them to the gates. That would be the easiest way for us to do it. Come on in, boys. Okay. Cavalry is coming. Let's do this. Attack all. You can do this, Steve. Oh, Steve got a swing in there. Let's go. Attack all, Steve. Don't be afraid. You got a stick, but that's that's all. That's all there is. You got friends that are going to help you very much so. The important thing is you, you loot these guys as soon as you can. And get their stuff off of them. That's that's very important. As you can see, I still have the military craft mod. Those guys are actually fighting quite well. Uh, that allows you to... Uh, Keep on going with uh, oh look that standard great rapture perfect. Keep on going with uh, certain moves like I've been using and with Ruka. Oh, they already stole the thing off of God damn it. Uh, that we're using with Ruka and so on and so forth. Uh, okay, we're gonna steal these two and sell them for almost nothing. And we can arrange this a little bit differently. We can steal this amazing rack shirt as well. Now, Steve's got himself a rack shirt as well. Hell yeah. You know, his mustache still shows. It's awesome. He's a bit injured, but that's fine. Uh, he didn't level up at all. But that's okay. I mean, we probably could go and try leveling up our melee attack a bit. But. But why not fight stuff first, huh? Why not fight stuff first? Because, I mean, we can Especially now that we have friends over here. And the fact we got this uh, this bad boy as a standard grade, it's amazing. Hello, friends. I've come back from that healing kit. Show me your goods. I've got a couple of these things to sell. This is a rusting blade, blade iron club. It's much better than this thing. So, we're going to use that. You know what? You can even put it in your back. It's going to make you look more badass, Steve. Look at, look at him go. Look at that. When we are indoors, we got three attack speed. It's amazing. Now the question is, do you have any better healing items? You don't, unfortunately. So we're just gonna buy the crappy one and be happy with it. There's just, you know, that's the way to go for now. Uh, if we were to go train, we would have to go... Oh, look, there's one uh, destroy longhouse. I wasn't aware of that. Uh, over here. Over here, they will have some training stuff. I'll pay attention to more Starring Bandits. Actually, let's go find more of these Starring Bandits before we do anything else. I think that's gonna, that's gonna be much better for us. Before we do training, we fight them. I mean, we have one attack now, so that's pretty amazing. Those guys will help us as well. Holy Sentinels. So what we really should do is bait these guys into attacking the Holy Sentinels. Yeah, come on over here, boys. There you go. High paladin, high paladins are coming. Oh, they're going there as well. Um, let's let's do the fighting, man. Nice, nice, good, good, good. <clears throat> let's have the fighting go all the way around. Steve, if you get hurt, that's fine. You need to get your toughness up. I mean, you, you you're not doing so peachy, but hey, take a swing, Steve. Take a swing. Now, of course, Steve is going to have to slowly start an attempt recruitment of his fellow uh, Ocronites. Because uh, he will for certain need friends if he is to do this. We'll steal these things because we can sell them for a tiny amount of money. And tiny amount of money is all we need right now. Unfortunately. Yeah, we have Rusting Blade, which is amazing. <laughs> Of course it is. Uh, don't heal yourself. Let's run for now. Let's see what we have over here. There's a couple more corpses. Oh no, you guys got wrecked. What a freaking surprise. Steve, he's gonna over encumber himself as well so he can train a bit uh, for his uh, stamina training. And by stamina, oh look at that! Unfortunately, it's rusted junk, which is not as good as you think. And this thing. Definitely want that thing. 
Fine, let's put this on my back for now. This guy is definitely going to have a bounty. Yeah, he's going to have a bounty. Alright. Uh, pick him up. Heal yourself. Yes, yeah, Steve. That's, that's a good idea. And then we're going to go cash this guy in. You healing him? Yes. Now, he is a bounty with the Holy Nation Outlaws. You see, uh, Steve does not like Holy Nation Outlaws. So, I guess this bounty ain't gonna happen. Oh, should have waited. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Because Steve's gonna deal. Hey, 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 come back here. Fight me. Oh, nice one, Steve. Nice one. Keep it going, man. Look at that. Okay, they, they've got friends. They've got friends. Steve, you might have stole their uh, weapons, but they definitely got friends. Those guys are gonna help me. I believe. Steve's got minus two attack. Uh, what if you rather go ahead and switch to this bad boy? There you go. That's gonna be better. At least you have two attack instead of zero. He's gonna get murdered in the stomach very soon so Steve you gotta you gotta move <laughs> wait are you still fighting he says I'm so dead he's still fighting from the floor oh I like this Steve I like I like the way you like the way you say this man hey leave me attack the other guys go Steve there you go outrun them outrun them don't let them punch you hey hey help help Help! Help, friends! You weirdos! Fine. Fight them all. Oh, there you go. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. There you go. Told you. Lucky dudes. Okay, you are gonna stay with me. I'm gonna first aid you. I'm gonna carry you around. Uh, I really wish I could go and carry him to the Holy Nation Outlaws, but Steve does not deal with the Holy Nation Outlaws. He might murder Holy Nation Outlaws, but that's that's about it. He's not gonna... He's not gonna be friends with them. Now, of course, we could store all this uh, weaponry and such on those guy, but... That's also fine. Grab this horse chopper. And let's, uh... Let's bring this back home. This dude. Yeah, I, I really wish it wasn't Holy Nation Outlaws, it was somebody else, but hey. Y you can't you can't have all of this, you know? Mm, I'll take these boots, though. Because you never know. Maybe we'll make enough money now to get another recruit. Who knows? We need to go look into bars. Maybe there's some, you know, free recruits and such we could find. Also, healing ourselves. That we'll have to do, eventually. But for now, Steve... Steve is just a nameless Holy Nation boy. Now, if you guys... Uh, would like to help with naming uh, Steve's faction Well, let me know. I would appreciate that. Also as always uh, If you if you ever want to be in a series just leave a comment down below with uh, your name your desired weaponry uh, Your desired race. Well, we are only gonna be humans Greenlanders of course now because of course we're holy nation. So hey That's it. Uh I got a job request. Defeat the enemy, secure human resources, attract customers. Uh, I would like to ask for explanation. If I were to secure human resources, you persuade people who are out of town and bring them into town. It will be our power if you can persuade them. This is weird. Whoever written this clearly isn't native English speaker, but hey. Hmm. Okay. Black Dragon Ninjas, Black Desert Ninjas, Bounty Hunters, and Mercenary Guild. Also find it near uh, near Dead Cat or Swampers. Probably Mercenary Guild wouldn't be too tough. Okay. Uh, I will try securing human resources. Okay. I will gather people for you. I don't know why this human resources thing is popping up. I... Okay. I... I whatever. Whatever is happening. I don't know, man. I don't know. In any case, let's go... Um, let's go sell some stuff. Shall we? 
How we look on stats? 4 melee defense, 2 melee attack, 7 toughness, 2 strength. Toughness going up is pretty nice. Strength training is gonna go up right now because we're carrying this person. So we're gonna keep on uh, carrying this person. Uh, I will sell you all my crap though. Because why not? I will also sell you this thing. And that thing. Yeah. There you go. How are we doing? 500 monies? That is crap. But it will have to do for now. I will keep those sandals. Actually, screw it. We're gonna sell sell those sandals as well. We can find more sandals if we need to. Yeah? Um, but I would like to find maybe a recruit or something. Let's go into bar. Let's see if we can find somebody that would be free. You know? Maybe a person that's free. Who knows? Who knows? I know... Uh, hold, there's nobody in here. Just a couple of thieves. We do not talk to thieves. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. Uh, do you guys have more? It's a bakery. There's usually people sitting up top on bakery. This seems like a quite quite an empty uh, empty place. This is a police station. Mechanical ninja's job. Uh, excuse me. By job, I mean shop. <laughs> uh, we do not do deal with mechanical stuff. Oh, there's another bar. Go here. Since we are holy nation, you know, we don't accept that. There's a boot shop. And there's not a bar over here. Okay, so there's like two more bars. Let's get Steve into one of those bars. Let's go check it out, man. Let's go check it out. Okay, now we're talking. We got over here. Griffin! That's my boy. Griffin is the boy we needed. I had a dream last night, the Lord of Light, Okran himself, came to me and he told me that I would meet a wealthy wanderer from the outside. The wealthy wanderer will lead me to the truth, will lead me to origin of the first extinction. With this, the land of Holy Nation will finally find peace. Griffin, you're the man we want. You think I'm the wanderer? Okran will show me if you're one, uh, if the one. So wonder, I will follow you, but it will cost you 9,000 cats. Do you have the coin? Alright, we are back to talking with Griffin. Hello, Griffin. <laughs> Uh, how's it going, buddy? <laughs> First extension, what is that? The destruction of ancient capitals thousands of years past. That's that's amazing. Uh, you think I will be the one? I, I don't have the money. But one day I will have the money. But yeah, we're back to talking to these people. There's some mercenary boys. Let's see if we can persuade one of them to, uh, to join. These guys are not, not gonna do it. Looking for work? Need cats. Yeah. Uh, we just don't have the money. Uh, what I did do is buy the glasses, by the way. I bought, I bought these glasses. And also Steve, uh, after reloading and uh, fighting again with some out, uh, outlaws, not outlaws, starving bandits. Uh, he got knocked out and um, he was in recovery coma for a bit. Uh, got his toughness up as well, so that, that works out well. Yeb is probably going to want some money. Uh, anybody we can talk to? Bard? He's probably gonna want money, so it's not even. Ah, uh, there's the nomads. Look at the uh, the mod I have for the like nomad ponchos or something. It looks kind of cool, doesn't it? Hold there, townie. I have animals. Uh, okay, not gonna buy your animals. I'm sorry, not interested in that. Just looking. If there's anybody we could recruit for free. That's that's all I want. That's all I want. Uh, otherwise, we're gonna have to start making money, which is gonna be painful. Actually, making money. In any case, let's go here and let's see if they're gonna let us do some training. I mean, we're friends with these guys, and they have a dead corpse over here. I mean, usually corpses are dead; they're not alive. But uh, just saying, we're gonna t pick this guy up. The reason for picking this guy up is it's gonna fix our strength a bit, you know, as is tradition. Hello, friends. How's it going? Well, why are you running so fast, Inquisitor? Don't you run so fast? Now, let's see if uh, they will let me train over here. Only up to five, huh? They do not mind for now, which is good. We're gonna speed this up. We're gonna do some training, so at least we can get our melee combat up to five. That would be awesome. Oh, boys, there's triangle bandits attacking. We need to get over here as soon as possible and get some of this loot off of them. Uh, Steve run Steve just run these guys will have Some stuff we can sell for good monies. So definitely taking that 
Stealing your tricorn hat, stealing this thing off of you, for sure. Because that's much better gear. Look at that. Awesome, Steve, awesome. Um, go, 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 go. Before they steal his weapon, awesome. This we can sell for nice money. That thing, uh, shirt is definitely better than our shirt. Taking that, pants are definitely better than our pants. Oh, uh, the long coat as well, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Sure, we will look like a triangle boy right now, but I don't have problems with that. There's a triangle beaker as well. Uh, drop this on the floor. Actually, drop this on the floor. Take this. Look, this is 1500 money. So we want that, definitely. We want this as well because it's gonna sell. Uh, this is 100 money. So it's not much. Yeah, uh, we're content with this. Good job, Steve. Uh, let's go loot more of these guys and drop more of their stuff on the floor. Look, this is this is all money. That's that's all we need. Could you please just just drop this on the floor? Thank you. I, I don't care. Just drop it on the floor. This is all shoddy grade, so we're gonna leave it. Oh, it was good. It was was good. I like when they attack. Okay, I think that's that's all. We're definitely gonna. I think we're gonna go with this weapon over here. Ooh, they took down one of the Holy Sentinels. Interesting, interesting. Uh, we're not gonna steal from the Holy Sentinel, of course not. This is not how we deal with this stuff. But we're gonna go loot this bandit over here. Probably doesn't have much good stuff, but... Yeah, it's just, it's just rusted junk. Drop this on the floor. There you go, this is that prototype. It's fine, we can't take that, that's okay. Good stuff, that is that is good stuff. Of course, we're still carrying this guy, but we kind of have to. Or else, you know, it's not gonna work for us. Uh, let's see, what's the nearest shop? This armory over here? It's going to... Uh, no, this is not gonna be a place where we can go in. Uh, mechanical ninja shop, sure. That's where we're gonna go. Steve, go sell something there. And then we can go back for the horn and all that stuff. Hello, friends. Yes, love and devotion to you too. Show me your wares. Uh, we are selling that, we're selling that. Keeping those two things, keeping what is on us. Uh, selling this thing, that's, oh, look at that, we got money. Money, 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 money. This is rusting blade. Um, I will sell this, even though I don't really think I should. We are on 3k. Give me this back. I will potentially be able to recruit somebody. Although, you know what? Screw it. If we if you don't sell this, we won't be able to recruit anybody. And if you sell it, we won't have anything to equip that somebody. So it's a problem. Oh, that guy's got bounty. Run. Run, run, run. Run, 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 run. Steve, put down whoever you're carrying. Tag this target, please. Just, just get in here. No, they took him. They took him. God damn it. I knew they would take him. He got some serious bounty right there. Uh, these guys got any bounties on anybody? No. Okay, let's go get the triangle horn. That's going to be your weapon now. Go take that. Go take the beak. Well, they're carrying him here. Hmm. I wish... What are these cage bees doing over here? They're following leader. Okay. Hello, friend. Would you mind... Um, dropping this guy? Like, I, I really would uh, love if you could do that. We're gonna go sell these two things. This is gonna be currently our primary weapon. It's a pole arm. I know. It's got good armor penetration, good attack bonus. Defense bonus is not so good. And there's penalty, of course, is happening, but we get some attack bonuses out there. So I think that is solid. Let's go sell extra stuff we've got right now. Because why not? And then with our 3k monies, we could go recruit somebody. Hell yeah. Not that what we have is good, but... <laughs> 
It's not like we can give anything to anybody, but I really wish this guy would drop the the bounty man. But the reason why he's not dropping it, I believe, is uh, everything is full. Like their cages are all full. Well, steal those back off of you. Take that. Uh, let's go. Let's go see what else we can steal. It's a prototype. That's just garbage. We don't want that. We definitely do not want that. That's that's better. Standard grade. Standard grade. Let's take this. I'm taking these things so I can equip another person, you know? Somebody's healing. This guy's dying. Ah, uh, we do have standard grade stuff, yeah? Okay, this is good. What you got? That's shoddy grade. Unfortunately, it's shoddy, but it's... It's gonna be better than nothing. Got caught stealing? Excuse me. My dude... Don't, don't even. Well, oh, you punched me badly. Chop him up, boys. Nice, Steve. Learn the pole arm trade. Learn the pole arm trade. Good stuff. Take the stuff off of him. Yeah, drop it on the floor for now. Keep this on you. This stuff, we don't care. Alright, good. Now, Steve, let's go recruit somebody. Hell yeah. Look at Steve. Look at this mustache and this gear. He's a beast. He doesn't need healing, he's, you know, he's a beast on his own. Let's go into one of the bars and uh, let's recruit the any worthless piece of garbage that would like to join us. Uh, of course, this bar is empty. Let's not go into this bar, let's go into this other bar over here. Yeah, let's go into this bar. Steve needs friends. If you don't, if you don't know that, Steve definitely needs friends. How about you, Bard? You have a katana and all. You seem like a proper man. Do you want to join us? There's a uh, Yeb, but Yeb is a female. You see, we are the holy nation, which means we are definitely chauvinist pigs. We are racist, all that kind of stuff. So, hey, uh, I'm going to keep on saving before I talk to people because uh, you never know. And I say, hey, wiggle over this way, muffin. I tell you, ah. <laughs> never seen somebody so steamed so fast. So I took the, oh, glass is empty. Say, Paul, lend me some cash. I'll make it worth your while. Uh, will you now? Tell you what, I'll say, sing you a song. Oh, this is Bard. He's gonna sing. Oh, this, this guy is just kind of unique. Right, how about a demonstration? There's once was a pixie above all the clowns. She soared with the zephyrs, gallant and proud. She went to the na 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 crest and swam with something, something, something her breast. She went to, to, I don't remember. They make her queen at the end. It's pretty good, eh? Surprisingly, yeah. Worth the price. 3k for the Bard. Now, since this is the first episode, I'm not going to be renaming anybody yet, because uh, you guys have not told me the names yet. So, this is going to be Bard for now. And uh, I think Bard looks quite okay. Confirm. Hello, Bard, my friend. How's it going? How's it going, son? Uh, we are going like this. That's going to be the first thing. Let's trade with Bard. He's got a rusted junk katana, which is absolutely amazing. Bard, we're gonna equip you, my son. You see, we have a dress code over here. And uh, you need to, you know, use that dress code. That's just the way it is. That rusty katana, I don't know, man. Maybe that's gonna cut it. Uh, I'm gonna give you a couple of these. I'm gonna give you one piece of meat. And let's go. Bard and Steve on a journey together for now. Uh, there's corpses out here, Bard and Steve. Let's see what Bard is good at. Uh, exactly nothing, so that's why I like him. I wish this guy would drop that dude. That would be amazing. Also, don't look at us. We're totally not trying to look like bandits. Like, for real, though. Bard, there you go. Unfortunately, it's sleeveless, but it will have to do for now, man. Uh, let's see if there's anything else we can take off of these people. Just shoddy boots. Doesn't really do anything for us. I did I think I sold all the all the monies, unfortunately. Sold all the monies, yeah, that, that makes sense. Exactly what I wanted to say, you know? We sold all the monies. <laughs> uh it's all shoddy, fortunately. Alright, well, uh, it certainly did something for us. So uh we're gonna open up with Steve. You're gonna pick up this guy. Bard. 
Did I make you a medic? I did make you a medic. Uh, we might make Bard a ranged person. I'm not gonna be racist towards ranged persons again this time around. Like last episode or last series, we only had one ranged person. And that was Hazard, who was God Amongst Men. I think this time around we're gonna have more ranged people. Uh, because we probably will have more fighters in general. In any case, let's go back in here. And uh, let's chill. Right? Right. Uh, let's let's go sell whatever goods we have. These guys will, you know, run slowly, but this is this is just the way so they can level up their um, strength a bit by running around with corpses on their shoulders. That's you know just the way it goes. And we need to send Bard in there for some training as well, so uh, Bard can uh, level up a bit. Uh, you know what? If we could buy back this stuff, that would be great. We have 570. We can't buy back this, can we? No. Unfortunately. Hey, it doesn't even say buy back anymore. So, never even mind. <laughs> never mind. Anyway, uh, he's gonna keep this triangle horn. And he's gonna keep his katana. And that's about it for us now. Alright, let's go get... Do some more training. Steve? Steve, I think, is almost up to 5. So that's good. But Bard, of course, needs some training. If he is ever to, you know, be up there when it comes to fighting. Because we're going to have to fight a lot of stuff, you know. Outlaws, bandits, all kinds of bandits. Uh, of course, eventually Shaq as well. We're going to have to go eventually deal with these guys in here. So, there's, there's a lot out there that the Holy Nation has to fix. And I guess we're going to be the ones fixing this. Oh, these guys don't want us training here anymore. Well, fine. We'll get out of here. What... What a bunch of dicks you are. We are we are gonna be your best army you ever had, and this is how you treat us? Well, we'll see eventually. So he's at four, Bard is at three. That's, you know, better than nothing, even though Bard's got like a really shitty katana. <laughs> uh, that's still better than nothing. Of course, they will continue carrying these corpses just to level up their strength a bit. Not that that's gonna, you know, happen fast, but hey, it's something they've gotta do. There's a bunch of nomads out here again. I think what we really need to do is go out there and see if we can really persuade somebody to join us. Also, how fast did this cage beast run? 10 miles per hour. Faster than us right now. But if you can get one of these bad boys towards the guards, we can then loot it for its meat. Guards, this thing is attacking us. It's a pup. Who cares it's a goddamn pup? Guards, help! We're being attacked by a nasty beast! Good, 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 okay. Go fight it, boys. Go, go help the fight. Murder the cage beast, good job. Oh, <laughs> 14. Plenty of meat, plenty of everything. Hell yeah! We'll take all of that. Uh... Steve, slew this guy. Let's drop this stuff on this guy. Yeah, and then do the cage beast. Let's drop some of the stuff on this guy. And there you go. Perfect. Thank you, cage beast, for providing us with all that meat. We certainly uh, desire it very much so. Hmm. I did say we're gonna go out there trying to find somebody. That we can persuade to join back here. That might take a while. Especially, you know, since we're still trying to train our stuff. That's okay. Uh, right, for Bard we need to buy some glasses. That's that's for sure. Let's go talk to this guy. Let's do business. Uh, Bard, you go ahead and sell him all of that. That's gonna make us some nice money. We're gonna sell that as well. And then loot this guy. Take this stuff off of him. He doesn't need that. And go ahead and sell all of that. Sure, we're gonna sell these two. Look at that. 3k monies. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Alright. Uh, right. Bard needs to buy uh, glasses. There we go. Ashland goggles. It's gonna make him look badass. Look at us. Just look at us. Bard and Steve. The most amazing people in the world that ever lived. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go cook that meat 
question is how far out there do we have to go to build a camp campfire? Actually really far. Go. Alright, let's go out there boys. Let's go cook that meat. Hope that nobody decides to try to eat us. There's the holy sentinel, so that's fine. We're not the fastest people in the world right now, but we're certainly, you know, leveling up our strength right now. So that's good. Alright, Steve. Uh, just start doing this, my man. Yeah, just start doing this. Bart, you got a couple? Trade with Steve. Steve's gonna cook all of these. Don't you worry about that. And then we're gonna have meat for days, to be honest. That's so, so good. It's gonna be, at least our food issues are gonna be uh, fixed for a bit. Who are these? Holy nation boys? As is tradition. Take all of that out. How about that, Bard and Steve? We got food. All we had to do was butcher some, some things. Uh, buying a backpack wouldn't be a terrible idea right now, to be honest. Steve, you gonna cook this bad boy as well? There you go, all of them cooked. Bart, you got some food as well. Let's uh, let's spread the love around a bit. There you go, yeah. We need to go buy a backpack. I think that's, uh, that's a good idea. That's a lot of boys. Witch hunt? <gasps> oh, do you see this money, friends? Do you see this money? This money is just absolutely insane. Go help, Bart and Steve. Go help. I don't care how you do it. Just, just get a swing in or something. Get a swing in. I don't think you got a swing in, but look at this money. Oh yeah, okay. We need to get a backpack before anything else. These guys are not gonna loot the beast, so we're we're good on that one. Uh, the problem is all the stores are gonna be closed right now, which is obnoxious. So we're gonna have to wait until the morning, or you know, go loot these things one by one. Uh, so what we can do is just sell all of our food right now Because we are gonna be getting it all back anyway, you know I think that's that's acceptable. Let's go out there Let's go get all the back all the stuff back Morning is here, and we finally cooked all the goddamn stuff. We had to cook which was a lot Don't call me odd man <laughs> We were cooking. We were cooking the whole night. And uh, I need to just quickly check if we really looted everything over here. Because, yeah, I thought there might be some more stuff, but that's okay. Uh, I think we looted all of these, though. Good. That's that's a plenty. Divine blessings, my friends. Divine blessings. We haven't sold so much stuff that we now have, as you can see, 9k. And we're gonna get up to 10k very soon. Uh, we're gonna sell most of this food because it's just too much. We don't need that much. Let's sell these. Uh, let's keep like four per each. And of course, we do have a bunch of stuff on these guys still. So, uh, you know, selling that is gonna also give us more money. <laughs> uh, as you can see, these guys are quite the depositories of food. So, uh,. After we sell all of that, uh, we're gonna see how much money we made, and we're gonna see if we can recruit somebody else. That's that would be the the main goal over here. Good. All right. Uh, sell that. Let's keep like four on each. Good. We have 11k money. That is, you gotta admit, quite a lot in the long run. So I'm happy. I am very happy. And I think before we recruit anybody. We're gonna finish the episode over here for now. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, of course, it's the first episode of the series, so it would mean a lot to me if you could share it with your friends, family, you know, whoever, whoever. Just share it. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll have fun. Trust me. <laughs> but otherwise, yeah, this series is gonna continue. We're gonna try to make ho the Holy Nation great again with Steve, Bard, and. Well, how many other people we eventually get in. But for now, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. Good crowd.